It has been an action-packed few months since the Winter Games, since Alana Myers-Taylor added another Olympic medal to her collection. An honorary doctorate degree, school visits, traveling the world, the BET and ESPY awards. Oh, she was elected the new president of the Women's Sports Foundation. All of this while she's getting ready for her What's Next. A lot has happened. Yeah, it's homecoming reception has been phenomenal and um, I'm just so excited to be a part of this great community and so excited to not only spend a lot of time in Douglasville this year but now in my new home in Smyrna and it's just been incredible. Being able to spend more time with my family, my oh. nieces and my nephews and, and there was an Instagram video of me lifting with my niece so, and to see them growing up and to babysit, oh my gosh, that's a whole other world. I could talk all day about that but it, it's just been really fun to be back. That's a whole training in itself. Yes. Oh gosh, <laughs> a whole new time, kinds of tiredness. You're healing. You know, I knew when I saw you after your medal race, Hi. you were in pain. And it wasn't until later when we actually saw that image. And to look back and know that you competed on that injury just makes me shake my head and have even greater respect for you. No, it makes me shake my head too. <laughs> The amount of damage that was done to that Achilles was crazy. And, you know, at the end of the day, I was willing to go out there and give it everything I had, and yeah. literally I did. You worked for that medal like maybe none other. And that's why it's one of my favorite medals. It's probably my favorite medal is because I worked so hard for it. But to be uh, seven months out of the injury now and just now starting to get back to running, it, it really took a lot more than I thought it did. Are you still thinking about 2020? Yes. Softball? I, I wanted to be able to swing a bat this summer and see where my skills were at, but it's kind of been delayed with the injury. Sure. Um, I still plan on swinging a bat next summer, uh, but we're kind of, kind of close to trying to really go for 2020. But definitely looking forward to 2022 and representing again in bobsled.